morning pot pickers. This is Stevie from Sunny North Devon. I haven't done a video for a while, but so I thought I'd uh, just give a bit of an update. Um, I'm just letting you see some of my uh, koi fry that I've got. Where they need to go in the pond, later in, well, later in the month maybe, or whenever really when it starts warming up. Um, I've got a few different types in there. I've got four, um, and so the goldish looking ones. One looks um, like a kuaku, but it didn't. Well, I don't think it is. But anyway, it just looked bred from the, the pond that I had before, or puddle. Um, but I've got a couple from eBay as well, which I got, give it, well, I got about a month ago. Not a month ago, sorry, well, on a bit. Back in September. Um, got one over there which I really like. He's an ugly fucker. I might call him Vlad or something like that. But um, also I've got that one there. I'm not quite sure what that is, to be fair. Um, but yeah. I don't know. Well, I'm assuming it's an old gone. Not sure. Um, there he is, there's Vlad. That. He's a ugly fucker, isn't he? Look at him, that. Just looks nasty, isn't he? Scares me just looking at him. Oh fuck it out! Scares me to death. Never mind. Anyway, there's uh, some more. I'm not sure what you think that they might be. Obviously, it was more of a, like a pick and mix off of eBay. I see the orangey type. They're just a mixed breed from from the pond. Um. So that's you know. Well, Temperature around about 18, 19 degrees, 20 degrees. Um, just got this fish mate filter to sat on, precariously sat on top. It's been there for two or three weeks now because I've changed my filtration. I did have like a, a pressure, pressurized filter sat in the corner where my golf bag is. Um, but here yeah, he is, look at him, right? He's staring me down, he is, fucker. That's good, but chills down the fucking spine. Look at him, that. Hey, look at him, fucking hell, really scare you. Hey, put your fingers in there, you fucking lose them, eh? Look at him, that. Yeah, oh, fucking look at you too, buddy boy. Anyway, go back out to see how far I've gone on since. Um, here's, here's the pond. Please excuse the shitty silicone around the window. I did have a bit of a leak. Um, was filling up I've smeared it over and we're just waiting for it to warm up and when I do um, you know water change I'll drop it down and drop water level down and um, clean it up a bit but um, also I need to change some of the uh, um, sleepers on the top here I got given a few short ends and I just need to tidy it up really typical me I fucking rush around with things um, you know, to get it in in time because I've just had a neop, just a bit of a clean out on my cartilage type thing, and I wanted it to a point where it was up and running. Um, yeah, so I need to tidy up those pipes as well along there. I've just literally just obviously bung, bunged everything in like that, but I've got two pumps in the pond at the moment. One's running the skimmer over in the corner there. Um, going back to a pressure filter and another pump over down there. You can just probably see the the green of the top of the lid. Um, you know, and that's just literally go back to another pressure filter um, and then just just returning back into the pond. Um, yeah, I've got I've got an air stone in there. I can't switch the fucking thing off at the moment because it's the back of the shed and uh, my knee will take it at the moment. Um, but yeah, water temperature at the moment is 8.1. Finding the fish at the moment are just, I can't really fucking see, you might see my ugly mug, I don't know, but they're just sat in the corner down there. Just, just fucking, just, just staying there really. I had one, um, that was just seeming to be, uh, a little bit lifeless and limp to be fair um, 
I did give it a little poke and he seems to be swimming around now. Not sure if it's, if it's like an Ojiba or might be a Chag, but it was quite small. Got it last summer. I do not really grown much to be fair, but then again, the size of the pond before, I'm not surprised. Um, but yeah, so it's it's coming on. It's still, it's still got a hell of a lot of work I want to do to it. Um, but you know, the, the framework's there. Uh, I just need to just do a few bits and bobs, a bit of, you know, playing around, altering those pipes, maybe. Um, just look at getting it looking nice. I'll be building a shed over the back end of the garden there, which is a bit of a shit at the moment, which I'll be putting all, all the uh, garden stuff. But at the moment, it's just literally, everything's just chucked in here. But I'll say we got, I've got two pressure filters, one up there, one down there, and uh, the pump just tucked in behind. Um, yeah, if anybody wants to give me any tips or what to do, you know, I'm all, I'm all ears type thing, always looking for advice. You know, so I do tend to, you know, I'm like a bull in a china shop at times with things. And then once I've got things to a point, then I then I titivate rather than taking my time and getting it right first time. It's just my, always been my biggest problem. But anyway, thanks for watching, guys. And uh, hopefully I'll speak to you soon. Take it easy. Bye-bye.